Hello everyone, this is Aida Golami from Agrimet Self Research Lab and in today's video I'm going to teach you how to hide unused rows and columns in Excel. So this will be a really simple tutorial um, for this problem and you know that whenever you select a column and right click and click on hide, it will be hide. Um, and also for rows, it's no uh, difference. And or if you select a range and then click on hide, it will be hided and it's no difference when it comes to rows. But in here, the problem is that when you have millions of millions of columns in Excel, you can see whenever you go to the right it, it it will continue it will also come to the right um, what will you do in here what's the um, solver for this um situation so in here all you need to do is to click on the column you want to start from to hide and then you um, hold shift button down and then click on end button click on end and then with shift down click on right arrow so i go in there you can see it's all selected so this is the um the end you know column the last column in here and then all i have to do is to right click on one of these so one of these there's no no important it's not important right click on one of these and click hide you can see it's hidden now so i control z and i wanted to mention a point in here if your system has end button and right arrow in one button so i have this kind of keyboard in my laptop if you have the same problem you know it's not a problem if you have the same uh, situation uh, select the column you want to start from uh, hold down shift and now hold down fn so with these two buttons i mean shift and fn buttons down push um, right arrow and end with uh, which are one single button you can see end mode is shown in here so it's not in there so it's not in there you can see there is no end mode in here i select that i i push shift and fn down i hold them down and now i push the end and um right arrow which are a one single button i push that and you can see end mode is enabled in here now i take my finger uh, up from fn button and then push the end and right button push that and you can see it gets this uh end of the workshop for the rows also i select that shift fn um i have page down and down in one button shift button down uh, fn and i pull back fn and page down you can see i go i uh, get to the end of this worksheet from down i right click click hide and that's it so that's it for today's video i hope you learned something new please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel i will see you in the next videos and bye